The Farms.com Canola Report is brought to you by the Clearfield Production System for Canola and BASF Canada. My name is Tom Wolf, and I own AgriMetrics, which is a small research and training company. So a big development in spring is the need for a, a wider travel speed range because we're going faster in general and we have to accommodate a wider range of flow rates with our nozzles to make that possible. We've got a, a few technologies there uh, that solve that problem and those same technologies also allow site-specific treatment. So for example, in your canola, if you've got some landscape positions that need more or less fungicide, for example, you could accommodate that with some of these technologies also. So the technologies really revolve around um, a non-pressure tool for changing flow. Usually, when you need more flow, from faster travel speed, you would increase the spray pressure. Now you've got systems that don't require that. Uh, one of them is pulse width modulation. It's a system that allows your flow to be controlled by a pulsing solenoid. And the rate controller just controls this so-called duty cycle. And that duty cycle allows the flow to change probably by a factor of five, which is much greater than a single pressure-based system can accommodate. So that gives you the opportunity now to go slow and the pressure of your spray system will stay good or go fast and likewise the pressure stays good. The whole time now you're putting out consistency in terms of droplet size and so on. Uh, there are three manufacturers of pulse width modulation. Capstan Ag Systems is the basically the, uh, the inventor of the system and they outfit uh, Case under AIM Command and they also do their own retrofit which is called Capstan Sharpshooter and Capstan Sharpshooter Pinpoint. Uh, a couple of new players on the market that are noteworthy. One of them is Raven. Raven has developed their own pulse width modulation system called the Hawkeye and they are uh, making it possible for producers to put that, sp that on their sprayers uh, by themselves. Uh, similar kinds of uh, ways it operates, 10 hertz, uh, uh, duty cycle ranges from about 20% to about 100%, so similar to the capstan, similar pricing, couple of other features, so turn compensation for example is built in. The third player is uh, uh, T-Jet. T-Jet has a new system called the DynaJet. The DynaJet is also pulse width modulated, has very similar kind of operational characteristics as those other two systems. All three of them would be wonderful for site specific or extending your travel speed range. There's a fourth system out there now which is new, it's from Hypro and it's called the Hypro Dual React. It's different from pulse width modulation in that it allows you to use a conventional or let's say a modern air induction tip. PWM systems don't let you use air induction. They have to use a cons a, a, an older nozzle style, a pre orifice style design. Still a good nozzle. Um, but the Dual React allows you to use air induction. What it does is it has two nozzle bodies in place at the same time. One, uh, both of them will be pointing down and then the rate controller will switch between the nozzles that are necessary right now. For example, a low flow nozzle will give you a slow travel speed and once you go too fast you can't use that anymore. Then you would simply turn on a high flow nozzle. It picks it up from that point and when you've run out of a speed opportunity with that nozzle then you put both of them together and now you have a third flow rate. That system extends your travel speed range, lets you use air induction tips and also gives you makes it possible to use a site specific situation. So if you have a prescription map you have to have maybe up to four times differences in flow rate that can now be accommodated uh, without PWM. So those are the those are the, the four systems. Three of them are PWM, and one of them is uh, is the Hypro Duo React. Yes, for more information, uh, uh, you can contact me at sprayers101.com. That's a website that has a lot of good, useful spray information on it for free. And on that site, you'll find email and Twitter uh, contact information also. The Farms.com Canola Report has been brought to you by the Clearfield Production System for Canola and BASF Canada. Visit www.agsolutions.ca.